insider access here. We get to see the Koenigsegg for the first time. All right, as a shade tree mechanic, this would be the first car I'd love to be working on. <laughs> so what do you think? A wrench on this car? <laughs> Here we go, so we're bringing Koenigsegg down. Actually get to see the engine in this thing. Look, carbon fiber on those uh, valve covers. You can see that somebody in their past spray chemical here to clean oh so what's going to happen john and uh um eric from detail the gig they're flying out and they're going to do a hand detail on this bring it down and bring back the collar and the lush the luster cool it's not too bad because it's right it's just right here yeah right here. i mean if we can get 80 90 percent of it off without having to remove the valve covers right because believe it or not i think it would be 4.7 valve covers but if it's not and the one of them breaks, you're, you're screwed. Then we have to make custom get the gaskets yeah. and everything. And yeah. the car runs phenomenal. Right. We're just changing the external hoses and all that stuff that we can access easy just to upgrade everything. Perfect. And also just get better breathing. Right. So what other plans for upgrades do you have the besides? Exhaust, it'll the exhaust will get done in August at Bowden House. Okay. Um, they've done all the other ones. They've cool. done all they've done five CCXs. Okay. And um, what else? The internal, the, the dash. Right. Did you get inside to take a picture? Yeah, I, yeah. I was in there, yeah. So basically the dash cluster will get changed out. Good. Um, and we're putting in, I'm putting in, I didn't want to do the Koenigsegg Gucker video. I, I saw the finer. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's the best, the best, the best. Smart. Yeah. Definitely. Any other minor like reliability things that? Dude, it's a fork. Okay. It's with a hammer and screwdriver. Yes. Awesome. Seriously. Awesome. And the shift, I mean, the shift, this car is so smooth. It's scary smooth. <laughs> um, and when, I mean, at 100 miles an hour, it feels like you're glued to the road. Right. Have you, it has, feels like you can go upside down. Has the car scared you yet? No. No. I'm not scared of cars. Right, right. But usually if you're not scared of a car, sometimes that means it's not enough car for Dude, you, right? It has stability. The Ford GT has 850 horsepower. Right and no stability control, no traction control. Right. If that car doesn't scare the bejesus out of uh, Good point. That's a good point. And the Ford hasn't scared me yet. I haven't gotten out of control in it, though. Got you. For a 12-year-old car, it's pretty uh, good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely ahead of its time. It will be timeless. I mean, just the, the carbon weave and everything just handmade, and you can feel yeah. it. But what's crazy is you, if you lift the wheels, because yeah. the first set of carbon wheels, see how rough they are? Because they had a they had a layer so many pieces of carbon on it because the barrels are carbon. Oh yeah. They look like hell, but they're strong as hell. Man. Yeah 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 yeah. Well, thanks for allowing us to like come in here because oh, yeah. this has been something that I wanted to see, and you know, just having the opportunity to get down here and just take a look at the insides of this thing. I mean, I like to know the insides. Yeah. I like to take things apart. It's already a part. <laughs> it's awesome. The crazy thing is in its 12 years of existence, the longest drive it's ever been on is the one I took at home. Right. <laughs> in the rain. In the rain. I've, dri I've driven it more than any other owner. <laughs> and I'm still trying. I think there's six previous owners. Of yeah, it. yeah. But one guy, one guy drove it a half a mile. I know that. <laughs> half a mile the whole time he owned it. <laughs> To me, that's such a shame because, I mean, yeah, it's a great car. It's a hypercar and all that stuff, but don't, it's, 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 it's not a $20 million F1, exactly. you know? I've been through the same thing myself, and I think that we, when we think a car is special, yeah. we, we go overboard on it, but then I think it's you also fine. hit a certain age where you're like, you know what? Yeah. Life is only so short. Enjoy the thing. Yeah. And... The hell with the next guy who's going to own it after you and how many miles he's going to get it with, you know. Fitting the superchargers on is going to be good. That was a big feat, but they got it on. Good. Yeah, they and that was some custom work to get, I guess, because they're bigger, they have to also increase the, the flow. The, yeah, so the intake's on here. Right here. Yeah. These will be increased to the diameter here. Oh, right. Yeah, because otherwise it doesn't make sense. Yeah, right. See? See, this goes like that, no problem. Yeah, so yeah. That's the new one. <laughs> yep. No, that makes sense. Yep. 
and they don't exactly carry this at Napa. Why not? But the the uh, actual superchargers have their own oil coolers. Yep. So. Yep. As they should. Yep. Yeah. Well, it's the first time. The original doesn't have one. Got you. Because this thing, it was 806 to the crank, and I think Houston got it up to, I think 680 okay. at the wheel with a tune. Okay. And then we're looking at 300, with not 350. Man, the axles are just so small on this for the amount of power that it's going to put out. That's yeah, the one but, thing I'm looking at and going. Hmm. But it's all high composite, you know. It's, Understood. Yeah, I mean, again. Understood. It's just the the part of me that that thinks, hey, throw on a bunch of bolt-ons and increase performance. You, you what else is going to break, right? <laughs> but think about it. Christian, when he designed this car, said there's three things he wanted: a light car, a fast car, and a car that you can remove the top on. Okay. That was his three specifications for the car. Yeah. And you know, and he's a car guy. And it's hard to get rigidity in a car that you right. can also remove the top on. That, gonna, that that is. We are going to do an Olin's update too, I think. What what's that? For the shocks. for the shocks. Oh, okay, okay. For the front and the rears. Okay. Do a full Olin's. We're going to see if they'll do it and make them to match. So what will you get when you change that? Just a better working shock. Okay. You know, the shocks need to be able to you know reduce reduce heat, all those kind of things, and you know. Though the the front shock is in the front is blown, not blown bad, but it's leaking. So you know because it's, it's an old car, <laughs> well, and it bolt, sits right. The, the, the seals go bad. The left wheel's bent. You know what it's from? No. Not from driving it, from towing it. It's been towed and strapped down so oh. many times. I never thought about that. It's warm up more of its life on tow trucks. Yeah, I never thought about just that. Moving from one place to another to go to shows. That's crazy. Yeah. That kills reliability. It's just how it is. Yep. Very cool. Randy's showing differences in the superchargers. So everything's got a chance, so we're changing the butterflies on that. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Being able to see this car for the first time and in person, big time. Love it. Of course, we got the brace here that goes over top of the engine. Some under panels here for underneath the engine. All the injectors. Throttle body. There's Koenig Zig signature exhaust tip. Exhaust pipes come down from the top, and so you can't see them. You only see this straight on from the back of the car. This is like unprecedented. <laughs> this is the first time I've ever really seen a, a Koenigsegg in person. No. Checking out that carbon fiber. The fact that they've done this the way they've done the seam, like it's oh, yeah. perfectly. Oh yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like it's remarkable. Yeah, after doing carbon fiber work, we know that stuff like that is almost impossible to do by hand. 